Okay, we have a doctor. He writes an order for vancomycin, antibiotics, 750 and 250 D5W, IVP piggyback, Q12 for three days. We have vials of vancomycin 500 milligram powder. You reconstitute each vial with 10 ml sterile water for injection. How many vials will you need and how much milliliters must you withdraw to make the dose? Okay, so we know we have 500 milligram vial. There's 500 milligrams of vancomycin powder in the vial. We're gonna dilute it with sterile water for injection. Once we dilute it, what's the concentration? Knowing the concentration is the key to all these problems. Let's set up a ratio proportion. So we know that we have 500 milligrams per 10 ml because you're diluting the powder with 10 ml of sterile water. So 500 milligrams per 10 ml is the concentration here. Very important. And we want 750 milligrams. So it's going to be 750 over X. And we're going to cross multiply to solve for X. 750 times 10 divided by 500. Okay, put out your calculator and do the calculation with me. Fifteen milliliters. Fifteen milliliters is what you need to get the seven hundred and fifty milligram dose. Okay, you're gonna need two vials because each vial has five hundred milligrams. You need seven hundred and fifty milligrams, and each vial has ten ml. You need fifteen ml, so you're gonna need two vials, and you can withdraw ten ml from one vial and five ml from the other vial, or seven and a half and seven and a half. But ten and five is is the easier and more accurate way to do it. Um, all right. So let me show you what the actual vials look like. Take, take a closer look at the vial. Look at the vial, vancomycin 500. Look at the vial, sterile water for injection. And look at the bag, dextrose 5% and 250 ml. And that's it, easy.